Good afternoon and welcome back to another BGC Battle Stadium Series 1 video featuring G-Shock Lee San Diego Regionals winning team. Now, I've never used a regional winning team before, so this will be interesting to see how well I can pilot it. We have the Backscalibur with the loaded dice, the Garganical with the lefties, the Goldingo with the gonna say safety goggles but that's Paldean Taurus at the bottom. Choice specs, that's the word. Meow Scarada with the Focus Ash and the Mimikyu with the Life Orb. You guys are excited for two days battles? Consider leaving a like down below. Anyways, let's get into it. Alrighty, we got Mullet or Malay. I'm not, I'm not sure how you say the name. I'm gonna say Malay because it sounds fancier. We have the Don Dozo Tatsugiri, we have the Arcanine Goldango, Sylveon, and their own Meow Scarada. Interesting. I feel like we should bring Eldain Tauros in the back and get our own um, Intimidates off. I feel like a Goldingo Meow Scarada lead may be pretty solid. Uh, that. Maybe not. Or maybe so. As if we lead with the back Scalibur and the back with that, we can pivot if need be. Ha ha ha. We may be on to something. We'll find out here in a moment, that's for sure. Why does no one edit their trainer cards? Seriously. You didn't even change your clothes. Has some style. Mm-hmm. Your terror, your terror steel. Let's see. I don't feel that there's a solid swap that I can do. I feel like if we go and just double into the. There we go. Terror Steel. Yeah, Terror Steel right away. Sucker Punch, get that nice little bit of damage off. And you're gonna outspeed. Maybe ch uh, Choice Band. Hold on with that focus, Sash. This is gonna be a vexed shadow ball. Flare Blitz into the Meow Scarada. I don't know if that was a good choice on your part yet. Okay, so your life orb Arcanine, we know that much for sure. We have the Tauros. Get our own Intimidate off. The Propeller Tails, definitely uh, interesting. So we're locked on the Shadow Ball. So we can rotate over Aqua Jet. And that will take care of the Goldingo. Whatever Blitz into Goldingo, definitely gonna hurt. Somewhat pre uh, on the back foot by a bit, but that's that's okay. So 
We send in the back Scalibur. The Don Dozo. I feel like swapping out here will be the best. Or tearing that one's gonna be our best bet. Aqua Jet's not gonna be very effective. But we wanna focus down this Dondozo. Because the swap was gonna be happening. So as long as it's not just a swap protect. Yeah, hops right on into the mouth. Get, get all your raises out of the way. Nope. Wait. Tarot, tarot would happen first. Get rid of that. So that way they can just look at me and go order up. Earthquake. Can we weed that up? And go in for that wave rush. Ooh, we're, we're not in a healthy position, and it's a lefty set. I think we gotta go for a protect here. You have a protect. So if we double protect, we'll negate the possibility of that double damage coming into us. That's the idea, because it's just going to use Earthquake again. Block, and block, come on. Block, okay. Yeah, it's going to heal a bit more. You should have preserved the... Meowscarada. Gonna use Earthquake. Yeah, I don't think we got this one. So unless we get... We either stall it a turn or not. I don't think stalling a turn's gonna help, so... Crits. We gotta rely on some crits. Not gonna happen. Uh, well, at least that crit didn't matter at, at, at such low defense with everything. That was not gonna go well. Anyways, we're still learning. It's okay. This team was definitely made for a bit more of a, uh, no, a regional best of three versus ladder. So there's gonna be certain perks that you, are perks, certain things that you would find in that style of battles versus just one v like best of one matches yes we'll continue battling yeah yeah i'm only in great ball well we'll just go straight into it like this no cuts make it fancy this time
not fancy, what do they get different? That's, that's the better word. Let's see who we can find. Shut up, chair. Nobody asked you. Searching for an opposing trainer. Alrighty, who do we got? Who do we got? We got black. And we have black with a no With the same team that we just fought. I guess this is maybe kind of like going into like a best of three. <laughs> So, assuming everything's the exact same, how would we adjust? What is this team even? I'll have to do some research on that. Uh, let's see. Preserving the Mouscarada in the back was def would have definitely been smarter. I feel like... If we swapped those two slots, bring the Meowskarata in the back, and maybe Garganical for some salt cure shenanigans, maybe our best bet. Yeah, because, yeah, I was, I was just thinking, like, that's not the same person as it. No, it was, like, Malay or something. I have the memory of a goldfish. I don't remember the name of the last person. I just know they didn't have a good trainer card. You see, and they have a good trainer card. Definitely a different person. So, let's see. Oh, wow. So since they're definitely going to be going for Mystical Spear is going to be not very effective. Oh. Do they? Do they? I think they do. I think they don't. Oh. Well, this water terror will definitely help out, at least in that regard of. Yeah, not very effective. They go for their own close combat. So now they're less likely to do the thing. To... You know what, sometimes you just need to get the chip off. Sometimes that's just what you gotta do. I feel like the Glaive Rush there, because that's gonna be our highest damage. And we Aqua Jet. I swear if now they do the thing, I will I will hurt on the inside. But they're thinking. They're thinking. Withdraws the Arcanine. Sends in the Tatsugiri or Tatsugiri, the Dondozo. Makes it rain again. They're gonna get, definitely be going for another make it. They're probably going to swap. I'm 
Yep. Sending out an Arcanine. That must have been a choice. Attacked. Wave crash. Not very effective. Damaged by the recoil. We bring in our Tauros. And we gotta go for the flower trick. Just weaken. Yes, I know, we're in the red. Protects. Should have gone for my own protects because I probably just lost my one shot of taking out the Dondozo in one go. Yeah. But you know what? That's okay. The Dondos are just protected. So we send in the Garganical. Pokemon. We swap the back Scalibur. And we Salt Cure. I was like, why are you showing super effective on that? But that's because it only does the extra damage on the water, but it's, yeah. That always gets me. Always gets me. Oh, Goldengo. Oh yeah, that wave crash is gonna hurt, but it is definitely a bulky mon. Get your lefties heal. Get my lefties heal. Icicle, just chipping it down with more Icicle Spear is going to be our best bet. We can love another one. Hear me out. Withdraws. Uh-huh. Do the wide guard. Sorry, he's a little thirsty there. Okay, you you predicted the wide guard. So we get so we get some of that healing going. Garganical. Because they see how much of a problem this garganical is gonna be. Oh wait, Goose can hit. Fighting, there's fighting can hit ghost. That always messes me up.
Oh, you switch targets. But you know what? That's fine. We'll get there. We'll get there. <laughs> Raid boss down. <laughs> Even though that's that was just the more than mini boss. But I say we're doing a lot better than what we did in the first one. Because we played... This battle's definitely got a bit longer. So we're playing a, at least a bit smarter. combat. Yep. Saw that one coming. I get some crits. Really, like, just chunk that down. So two more chances for big crits. One more chance for super crit. Oh, that, that was, that was our crit. Yeah, well, it's, it's, we, we did our best here, guys. We did our best. I don't think we can survive a close combat. But we can attempt to Clave Rush that. And you know what, if we live, we can recover. Okay. Lip, 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 oh. I was hoping that was. I had just enough HP, but apparently not. It's okay. Now it's just Backscalibur versus a Don Dozo Tatsugiri that I can't do anything about. But we played better and. That's what counts. Is even if you, you know, you have back to back losses, if you learn, and you, even if you do a little better and play just a little better, you've improved. That's what counts. Just, just get through everything. Just because I can. It's a little bit more damage before I go. Yeah, that's what I say about that. We did good. Not good enough, but we did good. I'm still wondering, what is this team? It's coming up against back to back. Good game, Black. I'm confused. So in between this battle and the next battle, I'm gonna do a little research. See you in the next one. Alrighty, so we are up against Daisy. We got the Murkrow, the Mousehold, the Goldingo, their own Paldean Watoros, an Armorouge, and a King Gambit. Very, very interesting. Let's see. Maybe able to bring in Let's see, ah, I do not know what to do for this 
set up. I feel like going for Goldinga would be a good one. A little worried about bringing. We may be able to get away with a Mimi. Bring. Maybe bring the Oscarada, or do we bring. Bring Taurus in the back. And maybe back Scalibur in the back. I did find the team from last time. It was from Hirofumi Kimura. I probably butchered that, butchered that. But it seems like it's the correct one. Thank you for having a good trainer card, Daisy. And so uh, I nabbed that and maybe we'll see that in another uh, video. Leading with the Okay. We're gonna attempt to do a pro gamer move here. Predict the potential fire move into it. And shadows. Ooh. Go for a protect. Yeah, we'll go for a protect. Or maybe they're going for a dark dark move. I don't know. But I would think they would see the Mimi and uh or see the Golden go and be like, oh, we should just murder. Flying. Okay, buddy. I'm okay with that. Hotel Cleave. It's the back Excalibur. Oh, Trick Room. Um. Yeah, I, uh. I have priority moves. Ooh, they are bulkier than I thought. Bust through the disguise. I should have. Well, do you know what that maybe with that boost? Go for the Shadow Claw. Maybe with that boost and the chip damage that we got off, we can maybe at least take care of if they don't. Okay, Armor Rouge protects, that's fine. Still not enough. That's fine. That's okay. Who do we bring in the back? Do you know what? This is perfect. Yeah, the Wataros. Who also has a priority move. Defiant, that that's that kind that kinda stinks. But we can aqua jet the armor actually. Yeah, aqua jet the armor rouge. Shadow sneak the King Gambit. You are bulky. Like, I thought for sure that would have taken that out. That was, this is what, the third turn of Trick Room? Expanding Force does hurt. That just leaves Golding. 
Oh, their own Goldingo. Worst specs, I don't know who's going to be faster, though. I'm just going to do split targets, just in case. Because I cannot risk... going down here. Another thing that stinks is... Okay, that's fine. So depending on who outspeeds... Mine outspeeds, perfect. Delete. Perfect. Okay, and we are out of Trick Room. Who is their final? Their own Tauros. It was a Watt Tauros. Intimidate. Hurts the Mimikyu. We're locked on the Shadow Ball. But we have Play Rough on our side. This will do normal plus boosted damage. Oh, that's... yeah. Oh, that's... Perfect. Absolutely perfect. That was... That's what we like to see. Good game, Daisy. I think I'm only gonna do three this time around, so let's get you guys that rental. And there we have it, the San Diego Regionals winning team. I know I didn't win a lot with it. There's a reason why I am not a regional champion. This team, very fun to use, very solid team. A lot of the errors were just more on user's part for sure. This was a great team that was built. I back Scalibur. I don't feel like I was I was using that properly. We had the Glaive Rush, the Icicle Spear, Ice Shard Protect, as a defensive water Terra. Doesn't have really anything to make use of the Terra, but sometimes you just need a good defensive Terra out of nowhere. Garganical, Salt, Salt Cure, Recover, Wide Guard, Protect. Salt Cure being its only offensive is pretty standard when it comes to Garganicals. Some may run a body press set. But just being able to be a nuisance of just start doing residual damage off with that Salt Cure and just protecting and healing up, stopping any earthquakes or make it rains with that wide guard. Just an overall nuisance. Once again, a more defensive Terra with that poison Terra type. Choice Specs Goldango, Make It Rain, Shadow Ball, Power Gem, and Focus Blast. Honestly, I did not realize that Goldingo can learn Power Gem and Focus Blast. Oh, I can see where those would be pretty good in many situations. Meow Scarada, pretty straightforward Meow Scarada. One thing to note, it is an overgrow Meow Scarada, not Protean. A lot of people have found that with the nerf to Protean, Overgrow is actually one of the, is kind of the better choice to go with for Meow Scarada. You slap a Focus Sash on it, they bring you down the Sash if they're faster than you, that Flower Trick's now doing even more boosted damage with that Overgrow. And that you don't have to worry about, you know, Protean taking you away from your other stab in case you do survive for longer than, you know, going down the Sash instantly. Got the Mimikyu, Play Rough, Shadow Sneak, Shadow Claw, Protect, give it that Life Orb. Mimikyu's always been known as a very solid Mon, and I'm pretty sure that in this, in Scarlet and Violet, it's going to be shining a little bit more than what it was in Sword and Shield. Mostly because you don't have a Pokemon gaining double the health and various effect hyper beams for three turns 
uh, Tauros has our Intimidator, Intimidator with that close combat wave crash, Aqua Jet Protect. Definitely no Incineroar, but still a very solid support option. Anyways, if you like this team, make sure to go give Zhongli a... or Jiok. Jiok Li. That's his name. A follow. I'm going to be leaving his Twitter information in the description below. Also, link to the uh, team overview, team report. That's the word for it. I don't use them, I don't know the name for them. That goes more in depth on this team than I ever could. Also, in the description below. If you liked today's battles, please consider giving a giving me a like. Let me know what you think of the team down in the comment section below. If you haven't subscribed already, also consider subscribing. Hitting that notification bell lets you know when these videos are coming out. Anyways, that's all I got. Until next time.